Every individual has their story. And as a young man in Sigularville, New Jersey, was kind of molded into a, a mentally tough individual. In the situation I was in my neighborhood, like a lot of people would pull each other down. It's like, oh, getting good grades isn't cool. Like going off to college isn't cool. Like making money now, driving before you have your license, that's cool. That's rebellious. Wrestling really saved me from a lot of that stuff. That motivated me. I'm like, I want to do, I want to do good. I want to do well. I want to control my destiny. I want to do cool things with my life. Everyone looks at me now like, oh, you are athletic freak. Genetically, you're just amazing. You were born with big arms and huge muscles, and you were extremely fast from birth. But I really had to put 100% effort in. It took a lot of work, effort, determination, really consistency to get to where I am today. The turning point for me as an athlete was realizing where I wanted to be. So kind of looking at the big picture. And looking at the big picture helped me realize that I had to do more than I was doing at that very moment to get to the top. I want to have that small edge over my competition. So everyone trains hard, but I think the last realm of possibility that people haven't really tapped into in the sport of wrestling is nutrition. Although it may seem tedious at the time, once you're standing on top of the podium, all the salads, all the kale, all the spirulina, all the corella, that was, uh, that was worth it. It's very humbling to get knocked down, to get taken down, to get put on your back. This man across from me has trained maybe as much as me, maybe more than me. He's made a lot of sacrifices as well, but he wants the same thing that I want. We sit this gold medal out here, mat side, and the winner of this match, whoever can impose their will on the opposite person, wins. Or the other person is dejected because their best wasn't enough. So you gotta do something every day that scares you. Challenge yourself to really break out of your comfort zone and get to a level that you can never imagine yourself on. That humility ultimately defines who you are.